Hello friendos, it's Bella from the Bookish Badger and this is another holiday adventure-a-thon vlog. Now it is currently day four of the holiday adventure-a-thon. It is 11.35 p.m. and this is my first update for the day because I am just the best at vlogging as I'm sure you guys know. Um, I didn't get too much reading done today. It wasn't a stellar reading day for me. Um, because you pretty much plan, I think, that it's not going to be a stellar reading day when you got a paper to write, so that was fun. But I read some of Holidays on Ice through the day, and it it is so funny. Oh my gosh. I had, I, there were times when I was just laughing out loud because it was just too funny. It's great so far. I'm on page, like, 43 of that, I think. And then I just finished listening to another, like, 45 minutes, half an hour, I think, of Cinder, and I'm on page, like, 116, I believe, if you translate the audiobook to the physical book. So that's where I'm at right now, and I guess I will be getting some points also for having posted my days one through three vlog to YouTube, which I will link down in the description box below if you haven't seen that yet. But yeah, that's pretty much been my reading day so far. I'm hoping that tomorrow will be better, but who knows, because tomorrow's gonna be busy too. I've pretty much just got busy days through the whole readathon, so whoops. But what you gonna do? Anyway, that is going to be it for this update. I'm going to read a little bit more of Holidays on Ice, I think, before I go to bed. And then I'm gonna go to sleep, because I gotta get up early, and I am tired as is. So, good night tonight. Hello, friendos. It is now currently 2.36 on day 6 of Holiday adventure -thon. Day 6, what happened to day 5? Well, I was real busy like yesterday, and I only got like 20 or so minutes of audiobook listening done and I was going to vlog just to update that little bit but what ended up happening was I was tired and I fell asleep on the couch and then I woke up at like 10 p.m. and was real disoriented and tired and I was like nah, I can't I'm too tired so then I just went to bed and that's what happened there. Also, yesterday I was freaking out because a long time ago I set a parental controls password on my Kindle so that I wouldn't buy anything on accident. And then I forgot it. And after some extensive research, it turned out that the only way to get to be able to access all of the things I would need to access only through doing the parental controls password, I would have to reset my entire Kindle to factory defaults, and I didn't want to do that, so I never did. But when just before we left the house yesterday, I turned my Wi-Fi off of the Kindle to see if I could listen to my audiobook without Wi-Fi because I wasn't sure. And then later, when I got home, I went to turn it back on, but and I needed the parental controls password. And I was like, crap, well, I know that I can listen to my audiobook without Wi-Fi, but I know I can't download an audiobook without Wi-Fi. So this is going to be an issue. So I ended up resetting it to the factory defaults, but then I had to get all my apps and stuff back, one of those apps being the Overdrive app, which is what I listen to my audiobooks on. And so I got that back, and it didn't, like, remember that I had an account. Like, no matter how many times I tried to enter my library card and password and everything, it was like, no, who are you? That's not an actual library card. I was like, what? So I ended up having to create a whole new account, and then it didn't seem to recognize the fact that I had, like, these books out before. And so I went to go check out Cinder again. But luckily, it was like, oh, hey, you already have this borrowed. And I was like, what? I need to make a whole new account, and yet you still remember that I had these things checked out? I am so confused right now. But luckily, it was all sorted out, and I got the two audiobooks that I had checked out back on to my account there and everything. One of those audiobooks being Cinder, of course. So... That is all settled now, but yeah, that's basically how yesterday went, and today 
I just read, I don't know how many more pages of Holidays on Ice, but I'm over the halfway mark now. Like, I'm just a little under 100 pages in, and the whole book is only, like, 160-something pages, so... That's that's going like that so far, and I'm thinking I'm about to listen to a little bit more of Cinder while I go eat lunch, so that's what I'm going to do, and I've got a lot to do today, a lot of which would be good for audiobook listening, but I do have to read some stuff for class, so I won't be able to during that time frame, but... I'm hoping to get a lot of audiobooking done today, and I'm hoping to get real close to finishing Holidays on Ice today because I would really love to finish another book. Anyway, that is the update for now. I will hopefully update you guys again later in the day, and we'll see how it's all going. Okay, it is now 11.01 p.m. on the same day, and I'm really tired, and I gotta get up really early tomorrow. But I just wanted to update you guys real quick to let you know that I am now halfway through Cinder. I'm a little, I'm just like 20 or so minutes over the five hour mark in the audiobook. And the five hour mark was the halfway mark because the, the audiobook is like exactly 10 hours, I think. So that's pretty cool. And I'm still at the same point with Holidays on Ice. And that's my progress for today. I entered it into the counter and we are... We are doing good. We are on target so far. So anyway, I will update again tomorrow with whatever more updates come. Talk to you guys then. Hey you guys, it is now day 7 of... Yeah, day 7 I think. I'm pretty sure it's day 7 of Holiday Adventurathon. It might be day 8. I don't know. If not, <laughs> I'll put up an annotation. I'm so good at keeping track of this stuff, guys. Um, I didn't get too much reading done today. It wasn't a fabulous reading day for me. I only listened to, like, maybe a little over an hour of Cinder this morning. So, not great. I don't expect to get too much reading done tomorrow, either. Or the next day, for that matter. But hopefully, I'm... Really keeping my fingers crossed for Saturday, for sure. I don't know about Sunday, but Saturday is looking like it's going to be a good reading day. But even though it hasn't been a great reading day for me, like, upside, Cinder is great right now. Like, before I was into it, but now I'm super into it. Like, stuff is going down. Things are getting intense. I just, I just keep thinking about it all day. Like, I listened to it early this morning when I was getting ready for work, and... I just couldn't stop thinking about it the whole day. I was like, I want to get home and know what happens next. But of course I didn't get to listen to more when I got home because I had to read stuff for class. And it's it's good and everything, but I just want to read Cinder more. So, but winter break and everything coming up soon. So there's that and that's when I'll be able to read more. Yay! Anyway, that is probably going to be it for this vlog. I think it's been like, what, four days now on this vlog? So I should probably wrap this one up. So yeah, if you are doing Holiday Adventure Thon, what team are you on? How's it going for you? The Twitter never updated like the totals or anything, so I don't know what's going on for all of that, but like where the teams are in comparison to each other. But I updated it last night and I updated my progress tonight as well. Anyway, I would love to hear any of your team spirit or what you guys are reading in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, do not hesitate to give it a thumbs up. Do not hesitate to subscribe for more content coming soon, and I will see you in the next video. Bookish Badger, signing off.